You keep prioritizing people who are not prioritizing you. Choosing people who are emotionally unavailable and trying to consistently prove how worthy you are, how lovable you are, and why they should choose you, as if you are in some sort of competition trying to earn your way into love. And it's time to take some responsibility and not blame them for being avoidant or not wanting to commit to you. Turn the finger back towards yourself and look at where am I not being truthful in this dynamic? What do I need to say? What questions do I need to ask so I can get clarity if I want to continue to stay in this dynamic? So maybe that means sharing your values and your intentions and your desires, saying that you want a committed relationship and hearing the response and then acting accordingly, seeing if your values are aligned and acting accordingly, taking action to put your desires at the forefront and seeing how they respond. Now let's say you do this and then it's a no. Beautiful, you know it's not gonna work, so let's move on. This isn't a time to be like, oh, I need to change who I am. There's something wrong with me and go into the woe is me. Your girl has been there many times, don't worry. Instead, it's time to step into your power and be like, all right, this isn't what I'm looking for. I'm going to choose myself in this situation and move on. Or maybe you share and you're very scared to share what you actually want, but you share and they say, that's exactly what I'm looking for. And now you have this clarity and it brings more intimacy. And then the next steps get taken to take the relationship farther.